Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you my nighttime routine. So the first thing I do every night is take the pillows off the bed, move them out of the way, and just take everything off the bed that is not supposed to be there when you're sleeping. Today I also had my diaper bag and my newborn's boppy lounger as well as a swaddle blanket and her pacifier on my bed because this was the day that I filmed my what's in my diaper bag video. So I store my diaper bag in my youngest daughter's nursery. It just goes right in the armoire that we have in there. Easy spot for me to find it. And I always know exactly where it is. Another thing I like to do before bed is to shut all the curtains in the house. I just feel like it makes me feel more at ease and just ready for the night. Moving into the bathroom, the first thing I like to do as part of my bathroom nighttime routine is to brush my teeth. I use Colgate Sensitive Pro Relief with whitening and I find it works really well and just makes my teeth feel very clean. After I'm done brushing my teeth, I like to take off my makeup. I was actually looking for my makeup eraser there, but I forgot it was in the wash. So when that's in the wash, I use just a face cloth. Tonight I have the raw cloth and some makeup remover, which I have from the body shop. I like to keep my makeup remover in the spray bottle. I just find it easier to get onto my face cloth and I find it works really well and helps me use less product. Once my makeup is fully removed, I like to actually wash my face with this Tea Tree Foaming Cleanser from The Body Shop. It works very well on acne prone skin, which even at 25, I still have problems with acne. So washing my face once a day at nighttime is a must for me.
Now I don't do this every night, but tonight I decided to put on some moisturizer. I have this Kate Somerville Goat Milk Moisturizer, which I got in a FabFitFun box. And I just, I was outside a lot today, so I decided to put on some moisturizer just so that my skin wouldn't feel quite as dry after being outside all day. Another thing I try to do every night is put on this Burt's Bees Mama Bee Belly Butter. It's supposed to help with stretch marks and things like that, so it's very important for me to put it on since I have quite a lot of stretch marks. My skin is very prone to that, so anything that helps that is a plus for me. Tonight I also put on some dry shampoo from Batiste. I just, I knew I wasn't going to be able to shower tonight, it was too late in the day, and my hair was pretty greasy, so I decided to just throw some on before I went to bed so that when I woke up it wasn't quite as bad as it could be. I like to do is just to light a candle right before I start on my daily devotional. I like to read a devotional just before bedtime if I can, if it's not too late in the day and I'm the only one in the room. Once I'm done going through my devotional and praying, I will watch a little bit of YouTube if I have time. I'll leave a link in the description box below to the video that I am watching tonight. I didn't want to put her content into my video without her permission, but I will be linking her video below. Once I've put my devotional back in its spot on my nightstand, I turn off the lights. Our lights are controlled by our phone so I can just sit in bed, hit the lights from my phone, and just go to sleep right there. Hope you enjoyed watching today's video and I'll catch you later.